Hi guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alice. I go by Hello Alice here on YouTube and I make art videos. Um, and uh, that was a very unenthusiastic beginning to this video, but it is 6.30 in the morning. Um, clearly I have taken a shower and done nothing else. Normally I don't show myself looking quite this unpolished on my channel, but I felt like it would be very fitting for this video. So I'm up at stupid o'clock in the morning on a Saturday because I'm trying to start doing like YouTube stuff in the morning because I work a full-time job and by the time I get home I'm really exhausted. Anyway, um, my apartment right now is trashed. Like there's one clean room in my apartment and it's my bathroom, everything else is trashed. And I'm trying to do some cleaning this morning and I thought before I clean, I should film an honest art room tour because I have gotten so many comments on my art room video that's like oh my god like it's so clean like my art room would never look like this and I'm just like I literally finished unpacking my art room the day that I filmed that video <laughs> that's why it was clean um, and while I do try to keep my place tidy I am not a tidy person I never have been um, so I thought I would show you guys what my art room looks like more often than not. I just finished filming a video um, on Thursday night and then Friday night I went and saw The Greatest Showman and I didn't do anything. So this is what the art room looks like after filming a video. So let's just show you some of the destruction. So if you're excited about this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you're ready to see the destruction that is my art room, then keep watching because it's it's pretty bad. <laughs> so let's just <laughs> let's just start with an overview here. First of all, my art room has expanded into my kitchen at this point. We have a bunch of Christmas presents, like art related Christmas presents chilling here, like some books. Um, also an empty hot chocolate packet. Wow. So good at life. And a tripod case extending onto this is December's medication, onto my oven, which is turned on. My oven has been turned on all night. Holy <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not dead. Whoo! Anyway, it is, it's also extending out over here where we can see the remnants of my pizza from last night. I'm such a good, clean human being. And over here, we have packaging supplies that are fully in the kitchen. Um, this is a giant bag of crap. If we go into it, you will see I have just thrown stuff in here. Like I have my old license plate. This is the Arteza gouache, Arteza gouache, um, all of which has now fallen out into the bottom. Um, yeah, this bag has more random crap in it. Um, palettes, not cleaned out, just dried and shoved in here. Um, washi tape, chilling out of the bottom of the bag. This is sometimes what I do when I like want to tidy things up, but I don't want to put them away as so I just throw them all in a bag and let future Alice deal with it. It's a terrible decision. Over in this corner, we have more crap. My easel because I was going to film a acrylic video and then I didn't. Um, a bag that has plastic wrap and tennis balls in it. I, oh, and there's some Christmas presents. Seems useful. Oh, and there's scissors on the chair, just waiting for me to sit down and stab myself in the butt. Over here on the floor, we have my acrylic paints. I couldn't go two feet to the hole in the bookcase where they're supposed to go. No, I just dumped them on the floor because I'm lazy. This is the case for my ring light, which is up here illuminating this darkness. And I still have my ISO set to 1600 because it's 630 in the morning. This is quality content, I hope you guys know. Just chilling out here, we have the beginnings of a painting that was never finished. This was the start of my YouTube art Artist Collective Queen of Hearts original painting that never got done. So that's just chilling there. This, is, <laughs> this contains prints and it's definitely supposed to be underneath one of these. 
and nope, it's just randomly here, along with a bunch of other random stuff that's been thrown into this. I, I mean, like really, how unnecessary am I? Stopping for a quick second to take a quick look at the floor, um, we just have a random art board that the YouTube Artist Collective piece was actually done on. There are <laughs> pieces of cut up playing cards, a cut up memory card case, um, mail and paper and packaging. Oh, I'm so glad that my watercolor paper is just on the floor under a tripod, not protected by anything but flimsy cling film. I'm a professional, you guys. <laughs> Over here, I have my trash can, which is spilling out. <laughs> Luckily, this is pretty much all paper trash. I'm such, yep, I'm just so good at life. Over here, we have the top of my cabinet. There was also a giant stack of mail, which I removed because my address was on all of it. Um, but I have a something I started and then, oh no. Oh, Merida. Oh, Merida, I'm so sorry. I'll finish that at some point, but uh, decided I didn't like the direction it was going and didn't have time to finish it, so threw that up here. More packaging just lying around. Our, our, our Shea watercolor paper, that's up here so the dog doesn't eat it. This is quality art storage here. Oh, God. Swatches. I just... Nah. This is just a dumping ground at this point. I have all of my acrylic brushes which have um, fallen over upside down into here. Um, remnants of fabric and some more Arteza products. They're everywhere. Watercolor pencils have fallen down there randomly. Just, yep. And over here we have my printer. Completely out of ink and basically useless at this point, it is now serving as a resting ground for a bunch of random crap, including, but not limited to, gouache paints, watercolor pencils, watercolor paints, markers, a painting, erasers, just... And then up here, acrylics, more packaging, more random tubes of paint just lying out, the broken lid lid holder whatever it is to my tripod had this for 15 minutes by the way broke it within 15 minutes and it's basically useless now so that was a good waste of my money okay let's let's just oh god i can't even move i can't even move stuff without things falling over so in the corner we have um just a box with a bunch more stuff piled on it christmas presents my new logo that i don't think i've like Put on my channel yet but that's part of it just chill in there that's where my hair dryer went so that's good to know this is the desk <laughs> just <laughs> i don't want to deal with it <laughs> so we have um the beautiful um pencil shavings that i didn't put in the trash because the trash was too full and I was stressed, and stress ate half a pizza, so I just did that because I'm a grown-up. Um, random pieces of paper and playing cards with like gouache on them that I use as palettes because all my palettes are dirty. Also, about every two seconds, I'm having to remove pieces of paper with personal uh, like identification with identifying personal inf information on it because I just have things like insurance cards lying around on my desk. Lots of paper towels from painting covered in paint. Taking good care of my camera, I see. A painting! <laughs> and yeah, this is the mirror that I was using so I could see myself earlier when I was filming the intro because I didn't use a tripod because one, I broke it, and two, that's not the kind of content you guys came here for. You came here for quality, professional content from a professional artist and YouTuber. <laughs> Clearly, that's what this is. 
and it's on top of an empty box. <laughs> um, haven't cleaned out my water jar in a while, so that's lovely. You know what else is fun? How ridiculously inconsistent the lighting in this video is because there's no natural light. I have this ring light up here and I have to occasionally adjust my ISO depending on where in the room I am and I keep forgetting to do it, but that's okay because we're being professionals today. I also have a bunch of ink smeared and splattered all over my desk. This is permanent ink, so I have no idea if it's gonna come off or not. So maybe I should have cleaned that up before it, you know, had the chance to dry for three days, but no, that would be too much effort. And over here, we have a motley assortment of, again, just more random crap. Um, a playing card that was also used as a gouache palette. What a waste of gouache that is. I just, this is how I was working on my YouTube Artist Collective piece, by the way. Like I just had all of these brushes and paints and pencils spewed out everywhere and I would just like try to find them. Have these been cleaned out? No, they've been rinsed and then left to dry. So, takes good care of her supplies. You can add that as well. This was also from the YouTube Artist Collective piece and um, also was used as a gouache palette. And to top it all off, we have a dirty paint rag and an empty can of Coke Zero. Yeah, mostly empty. Oh, and a broken paintbrush because I stepped on it. To be fair, this is for my nails. It's not like I stepped on a broken art supply. Oh, I thought I was done, but I'm so not done because look, there's still more crap. Um, on top of this box, which contains all my fabric, we have just a pile of things. Um, I have a bunch of stuff from Wish for a video that I don't think is out yet. Um, and paints and markers and more watercolor paper because that's where I should store it with a dog that has been known to eat watercolor paper. And canvases tripod just on the floor in the walkway for anyone to step on and to top it all off on top of my lovely little cart I just have a bunch of lighting equipment in an open bag just ready to fall over okay so that was my honest art room tour I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the gigantic mess that is my art room most of the time. This is what my life is really like. I am not um, this put together person that you see online. So just makeup and cleaning. Mostly this is my life. But I think it's important to show, you know, when things are messy that like there's a, there's a lot of pressure, I feel like, on artists and young people today. Like, I put a lot of pressure on myself, and I think you guys do too. And I don't feel like it's helping when, with like, Pinterest and Instagram and everything, so like, aesthetic and like, perfect, and everyone's just like, mood, and like, lit, and fa- I'm sorry, I should not be allowed to communicate with people under the age of 27. Um, but I feel like with Instagram and Pinterest, everyone just thinks like, everyone's like, house and home and space is perfect all the time and the reality is is that it isn't. Art is messy and sometimes you get busy and you don't have time to clean up constantly. So welcome to my life. If you guys liked this real quality professional content filmed at 6 30 in the morning with no makeup before I've done any cleaning, um, then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if your art room is normally messy or clean or if you are like legitimately horrified right now. If you're my mom, I'm sorry, <laughs> but it's fine. I live by myself. Um, and yeah, that's it for this video. If you want to see my actual art room tour, I will link it down below and it should have also shown up like in the little eye um, earlier. So check that out if you want to see what this place looks like when it's not messy. If you're new to my channel and you liked what you saw, then don't forget to subscribe. Come join the Wonderland fam today. Hit the notification bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. I do upload new videos every Friday and they are not all total crap. Um, so thanks for watching and as always, have a great rest of your day. Bye guys!